Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, history fans around the world, I am Robert Huddleston. This is Huddleston Hideaway, and I'm going to tell you what happened upon this day, October 16th. 1813. Napoleon lost the largest battle in European history up until World War I at Lipsy against a confederation of Russians, Prussians, and Austrians. The three of them to gang up on Napoleon to get the better of him. Upon this day, in... Oh, no, we're going to come back to that one. We're not going in order today. Upon this day in 1908, Jack Johnson, the Galveston Giant... I mean, he was only six foot one, but that was enormous back then. The Galveston Giant knocked out Stanley Kitchell in Australia, becoming the first black boxing heavyweight champion and an international sports superstar. Let's hear it for the champ. In... 1923, the Disney Brothers Cartoon Company was founded. Upon this day in October 16th, 1934, the 6,000-mile long march undertaken by the defeated Mao Zedong, thousands of his troops, and his pregnant wife started in the south and marched north and west through China. Don't feel bad for him. He's not a good guy. And he won. But his famous long march did begin today. Upon this day in 1950, The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe was published. We all read that in school. It's the only reason Americans know about Turkish Delight. It was a good book. I normally trash mouth kids' books. That's not holding my attention. It was a good book. It really was. The Cuban Missile Crisis started upon this day. They showed... JFK, the pictures that we had Russian nukes in the Gulf of Mexico. And interestingly, my wife's dad was on, well, I couldn't tell you the name of the boat, God bless, but was on one of the boats in the Gulf when it happened. He said suddenly they were on red alert and nobody told them what they were doing, what was really at stake. And uh, interesting story, man. That happened today. But most importantly, today... In 1820, upon this day, October 16th, in 1829, the Tremont Hotel opened up in Boston, the first modern U.S. hotel, paving the way, setting the standard for the rest of us brave innkeepers and hoteliers. All that did indeed happen upon this day, October 16th. Behave, be brave.